Hi guys. It is another gray, gloomy, drizzly, yuck, depressing day here in the end times in the paradise of Garfield, Texas. Although my garden loves this gloomy weather, so I can't complain too much <coughs> here on this uh, just, you know, just another fucking day in the end times. Tuesday morning, November 6th. So, of course, we all know what the day is. Uh, it is election day where people are out voting. Out voting <clears throat> to change anything in the political system. That was bullshit. Uh... But, you know, I, I do support anybody, anything we can do at this point to get rid of Donald Trump uh, has my vote. Although I will not be voting today. Uh, anyway, so I understand that that is the only thing on the news today. But uh, there are actually, unbelievably other than that, uh, a pretty good supply of doom and gloom <coughs> headlines on the mainstream media this morning and <coughs> just trying to pick one of them. So, <coughs> I almost threw a dart. And uh, this is where my doomer dart landed, and it's as good a place as any. <coughs> we haven't heard about this story in a while, so I'm glad to see this update from the French news service, <clears throat> mining Bitcoin, mining Bitcoin uses more energy than Denmark. No shit, Sherlock. And I will never understand what the hell mining Bitcoin is. But anyway, whatever it is, it's just such a perfect example of, of why we are so fucked. Uh, on this planet. It, it's uh, the are, we are so fucked headline that uh, it, it just connects the dots between uh, everything. Uh, energy use, climate change, and above all, clueless fucking greedy morons. That uh, <clears throat> if anybody has a chance to get to mine a Bitcoin. Fuck the planet. I want a Bitcoin. I've never known what the fuck a Bitcoin is. Anyway, take it away, French News Service. <clears throat> Extracting a dollar's worth, one dollar's worth <coughs> of cryptocurrency such as Bitcoin from the deep web consumes three times more energy than digging up a dollar's worth of gold, researchers said yesterday. There are now hundreds of virtual currencies and an unknown number of server farms around the world running around the clock to unearth them. More than half of them in China according to a recent report from the University of Cambridge, mining virtual currencies with a real-world value, in other words, carries a hidden environmental cost that is rarely measured or taken into account. No shit, Sherlock. This is uh, Mark Krauss, a researcher at Oak Ridge Institute for Science and Education and a lead author of the study in the journal Nature Sustainability. Quote, we now have an entirely new industry that is consuming more energy per year than many countries. In 2018, Bitcoin is on track to consume more energy than Denmark, close quote. Um, for those of you like me trying to figure out what the hell they're talking about here, you'll just have to live with this. 
<clears throat> the highly competitive practice of mining cryptocurrencies requires hundreds, even tens of thousands of linked computers running intensive calculations in search of the internet equivalent of precious metals. New coins, coins are awarded to those who complete calculations first. Uh, with, with the transaction confirmed and entered into the currency shared public ledger known as the quote blockchain. Blockchain is, is another term that I, that I just uh, don't even try to pretend I will ever understand what the fuck a blockchain is. Um, Alright, the top 100 cryptocurrencies now have a current current market value of about 200 billion dollars or 175 billion euros. Bitcoin amounts for more than half of that amount. So uh, the study in the study uh, Kraus said, quote, we wanted to spread awareness about the potential environmental cost for mining cryptocurrencies. Just because you are creating a digital product, that does not mean it does not consume a large amount of energy to make it. Of course, the movies, music, and videos, such as the as YouTube videos, that billions of people stream every day, also all have measurable environmental cost, research has shown. Uh, but nothing uh, on the level of, uh, of this shit. I mean, I'm not... Have you ever even heard of these damn? Here's Ethereum, Litecoin, Monero. Good God. Uh, anyway, breaking all of this techno uh, jargon down, um, cryptocurrency mining is up to uses up to three times the energy needed to excavate gold platinum and copper. Uh, only aluminum was more energy intensive to mine. Um, and any complete calculation of the environmental cost of virtual currencies would have to take into account the banks of computers used to mine them. Quote, the computers are made with gold and other precious metals. They are run aggressively, which means the hardware is destroyed much quicker than you or I would expect for regular use. Maybe a year instead of five or ten. No shit, Sherlock. Anyway, guys, uh, y y you know, it, it doesn't matter where you turn anymore. Uh, fucking Bitcoin. Oh God! And and I could have just picked any any one of these uh, stories, mostly from the science pages, uh, as we're all talking about how voting is going to make a fucking difference on how fucked we are on this planet. Um, anyway. So I'm going to put on my Collapse Chronicles hat now, and we're going to go over to Collapse Chronicles, assuming I still have another YouTube channel, and look at Hopium. And I think for the few of you who heard that uh, rant yesterday about uh, Collapse Chronicles being shut down, I'm trying to give the benefit of the doubt that, that what Google is concerned about is it's not the YouTube channel. 
it's apparently, and this is just just what I'm thinking, I have two Gmail accounts, one called collapsechronicles at gmail.com and one called thecollapsechronicles at gmail.com. And they are claiming that I am uh, ba basically, you know, creating two accounts with the exact same content, which is not true if Google would give me a chance to explain. But uh, when I checked a few minutes ago, Collapse Chronicles, uh, the YouTube site, was still up and running. So hopefully that was just a one-offer from the uh, Google cops and not something that uh, will happen again but speaking of hopium, if you want to hear some more about hopium, come over to Collapse Chronicles. Smoke them if you got them, guys. We all know why. And it's bigger than Bitcoin. Bye, guys.